Welcome, I'm Jonathan, the appliance dude here at Curto's in Westchester County. An important program that's about to be released that was just uh, brought to my attention. It was actually brought to my attention a few weeks ago, but I had to shut my mouth about it. Um, there is going to be a new rebate program from the Viking Range Corporation that actually starts on October 1st, but we'll probably write some business before then and make you eligible for it. Um, they are coming back with a, uh, a rebate program to incentivize customers to buy packages of Viking, pro Viking uh, equipment. And what they're doing is, this is something similar to what they did about two or three years ago, probably two years ago, where you buy the Viking cooking product, and this is the professional stuff here, the, uh, the five and the seven series. You're going to buy a, um, um, a Viking range top plus wall oven, cook top plus wall oven, or by a Viking range, and you're immediately going to get, you become eligible for a free dishwasher. And their dishwasher is definitely rock solid. Um, it's their basic dishwasher, uh, and you can actually upgrade that to their more top of the line dishwasher, their 300 series. Then, here's the wrinkle. You buy a professional refrigerator, then you're getting free ventilation. Hmm. Where did, doesn't that sound familiar? Yes, it's actually something that has that has buttered Thermidor's bread for the last I don't know what has it been seven years, six years since they started the one two free program, and um, again this is something that Viking did offer a few years ago, and yes we did see some pretty solid sales from that. Um, Right now, the way I look at the landscape with the high end, I mean, you got Sub-Zero Wolf really without a promotion. I mean, I mean, unless you consider buying Wolf Gourmet stuff a promotion. I mean, most of the high end business I'm writing with Wolf uh, and Sub-Zero, people don't even ask about um, getting the free gourmet products. Thermidor is absolutely a locomotive um, with, their, uh, with their promotion. It just keeps getting, you know, they're actually adding more and more pieces to it. Um, it just, it's an absolute home run. GE Monogram has a very rich program and there are some other brands out there who I don't bother with who I believe have very rich programs as well. Viking, for the past year, you know, I think there was some, there was some reticence on their, on their behalf up top <coughs> to involve themselves in giving away free product. I think the idea was kind of like, hey, our product is so good, especially on the cooking side, we don't need to give stuff away for free. So they were incentivizing you monetarily. Um, did it work? Probably not. And so they've come back with a new program where the free product is going to roll again. This is going to run from October 1st to December 31st. So the million dollar question here is, um, Okay, cool. I'm gonna get a free dishwasher. Do I really want a Viking dishwasher? I wanted a Bosch. I wanted a Meal. I wanted an Asco, KitchenAid, whatever. It's a very solid dishwasher. Okay, um, I've had no complaints on the ones because I never really sold one by itself. People usually don't come in looking to buy a Viking dishwasher. It's actually been part of packages. So, and I've never had a, a, a negative comment about one. So I think getting the free dishwasher is nice. It's a nice perk um, and buying the cooking equipment. Really the million dollar question is gonna come down to the refrigeration, which uh, there still seems to be a great deal of, um, let's just say allergic reactions to folks on the sales floors when you mention Viking refrigeration, which actually I'm sitting in front of one right now. Do you sit, let, let's see that, that's a 42 inch, okay, Viking fridge. And um, this topic actually really needs its own video because what people need to understand is that the Viking built-in refrigeration, I mean, I'll put it in very colloquial terms, it no longer sucks. Middleby has brought a much uh, greater focus on quality assurance and um, things that in manufacturing processes that, you know, I think they use a Six Sigma approach and. They have uh, a variety of MBA-esque terms that they use in their production um, uh, you know, processes that were not in place before uh, when the old regime was in charge and it was just kind of like, hey, let's just get this shit rolled out onto sales floors and try to get sell some blenders and uh, get people coming to our hotel. You know, it was a different mindset. Uh, Middleby, because of their track record in the commercial space, is totally focused about selling products that are innovative and that, more importantly, they work. So. They would not. They would not be out there 
um, hawking these refrigerators if there were still you know, a myriad of problems with them. I can tell you, I'm not gonna lie to you, I'm not gonna tell you that we're clipping numerous Viking built-in fridges per week because we don't. We do that with Sub-Zero, uh, you know, we do that with Thermidor. Um, you know, the Viking refrigerator, quite frankly, it's because people are still reticent about it because of what's written on the internet. And I'm here to tell you that you really shouldn't be afraid. You should not be afraid about buying this product. Um, they have been completely overhauled from top to bottom. And again, I'm not going to focus anymore in this conversation about the fridges because I really think that, that it, it needs to have its own um, segment, its own video post, so we could actually break it down. We'll actually take a look at what the problems were admit where the issues were, which actually Vikings should have done this, not the appliance dude. Um, see what the problems were and see what they, how they address them and how the new refrigerators have so much more going on. They're really, they're great boxes. Um, so back to the rebate. Um, again, it's going from October 1st to December 31st and we'll, whether, depending on the success of it, we'll see if they continue into next year. But I really think that you know, for the Viking customer, you shouldn't go into it saying like, you know what, I like the seven series range, I like the French door wall oven, um, but we'll hook up the Viking on the cooking side of things, and then we're gonna buy, you know, we're gonna buy somebody else's built-in fridge or something like that, because I think there's something to be said for buying everything under one umbrella. I mean, there's two sides to that. One, the a la carte approach, which is I'll do a Viking, um, I had a sale actually, about two weeks ago, they bought a Viking 7 Series range top, they bought a Sub-Zero, they bought an ASCO dishwasher, they were like, he just cherry-picked, and he's like, hey, I want the best of breed in every category. I'm seeing a lot more of that, but I also think there's something to be said for buying everything under one umbrella, so there's uniformity in the look, the texture, and also, more importantly, you have a turnkey solution, one turnkey solution in terms of service and, um, and, and other potential issues that might crop up. Um, I do have great faith in Viking as far as their customer service. I have had some, I did have a couple of service issues recently on their ranges and they were addressed pretty quickly. So again, um, you know, Viking will have a home here so long as they continue winning up problems. They act, number one, churn out great product. And number two, when there is an issue with that great product, they deal with it like this. So folks, don't be scared off. Take a look at this rebate program. It's a really, really good rebate program. Um, I mean, it's really pretty much right on par there with Thermidor. And I would give, you know, talk to your salesperson um, about the refrigeration. If they've been trained the right way, they'll have some, you know, they'll present it in a light that it should be shown in. If they're telling you stay away from Viking refrigeration, they suck, they this, that, this is a person who either just does not want to do business with Viking or that they um, are not educated on the new product or the number three, they don't sell Viking. There's a lot of guys who are, who are in that position. So if you have any questions, please email me, Jonathan Jonathanacurtos.com. I implore you to come visit us here in Westchester. We have a very nice Viking display. Um, we can. Everybody here has been trained on the, ref, the new refrigeration platform, so we could talk to you about it. And uh, that's about it. I will follow up with another video focusing on the fridges, and then we're going to throw that out to the universe, and then hopefully uh, we'll we'll see if that uh, helps uh, the folks over at Viking. And um, and that's about it. But any questions, you know where to get me. Thank you for your time.